Hey everybody, thank you for joining me. This is Bug Powder Dust, and uh, here we go again, Colony 2, after the rather brutal and premature end of our previous colony to a fiery mech death. We only just lost, but we lost. So, starting again, Colony 2. I've created a world just to save a little bit of time, so I'm going to go with a new colony. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to just accept the three settlers, um, or the three colonists that it gives me. I'm not going to muck around and try and get particular skills that I'm after, so I'm just going to go with what it gives me. Um, so a new colony, Cassandra Classic, um, and we're going to go on Challenge again. So I'm going to go Next, just, uh, choose the world that um, I've pre-made, and I'm just going to go with the um, three settlers that it gives me. So I'm not going to go with mountains this time, I fancy just doing um, one out in the open, just out in the open, um, in the middle of somewhere, so not, not, not a beach. Um, out in the open, not burrowing into mountains, so just here we'll do. Tropical rainforest, flat, something like that. Yep, cool. That'll do. Select site. Gonna go with what, what it gives me. Um, so we've got Odile, an empath, incapable of violence. Mm. Okay. Um, that's what we're looking at here. Growing plus four, mining plus two, shooting minus three, and social plus eight, medicine plus two, can't do any hunting. Okay, that's fine. Um, it's always good to have somebody who's good with social. Thunder, who's a programmer. Mm, okay, so he doesn't do plant work or mining. Uh, what have we got here? So growing minus three, research plus eight. So he's good with that. He can't do plant cutting, mining, or growing. That's fine. But he's good at. Uh, he's decent at shooting. Doesn't do artistic, but that doesn't matter. Okay, fine. So we've got somebody who's good at research. I'm really kind of hoping this guy's. Yeah. Okay. Good. Shooting eleven, melee eight, social ten. But he's the incapable of intellectual dumb labour skill. Oh, Gordon Bennett. So he's actually no good at. Uh, any kind of hauling or any of that stuff. Clean and disabled, hauling disabled, crafting disabled. Oh my god. So, right. He's going to be a bit of a precious flower then. So he's going to be the one who's going to be doing the hunting. Presumably he'll haunt, um, haunt. He'll haul what he hunts. Um, okay, so he's going to be our hunter. But he's not going to be chipping in. Okay, that's going to be a challenge. Well, that's fine, we're going to go with that. Let's click on start and let's get started. I miss Tasha. <laughs> Here we go. They arrive. Okay, let's have a look, quick look around. So we have got some, some rock bits and pieces here. Um, to be expected, I guess they're on most maps. Now what I'd like to do, I need to set up near a geothermal. Uh, so this will do here. Um, I'm not too worried about the, the rocks. I want to set. I want to start it out in the open. So what I intend to do first then is to let's equip these guys. Now who's the guy with the shooting? Right. So he's good with shooting. I'm going to give him the pistol. And normally I give the person who's good with shooting um, the the Enfield, but to be honest, they shoot fire so slowly. Um, it's kind of pointless. So I'll give him the Enfield and I'll deal with the pistol. Okay. That's fine. Um, let's set up a stockpile. We'll use that as um, part of the uh, structure of the building, I guess. Okay. Um, let's get a structure up straight away and um, I'm wondering if the guy who doesn't do any labour, if that includes construction. We'll soon find out. So let's get um, let's get building up very quickly. We're going to go with wood. But having said that, no, we need, to, we need to get a stockpile up, don't we? Zone, stockpile. Uh, let's just put it here for now. It's going to be in approximately the right place. And let's allow all of this. Um, that's all the stuff in the general vicinity, I think. Yep, not seeing anything else around here for now. Okay, cool. Right, so that that's that. Now, next thing we need to do is um, get the structure up. I'm guessing if you add uh, wooden walls to this and a door, it creates a roof. I've never done it before, so we'll find out the hard way. Um, sorry, wooden wall. There you go. I'm going to actually expand that out slightly, get quite a big. I'll just kind of go with the flow for now, and I'll worry about exact sizings later. And stick a door in for now. Oops. A bit of lag there. Wooden door. 
like that. Okay, great. So that's that queued up. Now, this is a guy that's not going to be doing any work. Does he do construction? McKinney. No, in fact, he doesn't do a great deal of anything. He does hunting, he does wardening, patient doctoring, and firefighting. Okay, fine. Let's get you hunting then, because I can't have you standing around doing nothing. Uh, orders. Hunt. Okay. Right, dude, go get to it. McKinney? Yes, you? Hunting monkey. There we go. Awesome. Right, so we've got the foundations going in. The speed's up. Okay, who else is hunting? Thunder. No. That's not happening. Thunder, I want you to concentrate on not hunting. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna sort this out as well. I'll put it on manual manual priorities in a minute. Monkey down, monkey down. That's is this set up for corpses of animals? Yes it is. No it's not. There we go. It's now. Now, where's all the other spare bits and pieces? So we've got 300 metal, which I think... Oh, just realised I'm not going to be able to get a geothermal um, power station on that. I'm going to be making a mistake right from the start. <laughs> oh no. Okay. We'll go with solar for now. And as soon as we've got um, the, the, those pumps, we'll turn this into... Um, which I think you can do with the uh, the pumps, uh, what are they called? Fertiliser pumps. I think you can convert that to um, normal soil and then you can I can put a geothermal plant on it. So for now I'm going to have to go with solar again. But that's okay. Right, so what I need to do then uh, for now is give my guys a sleeping zone, which is not under zones, it's actually under furniture. Sleeping spot. So I need to catch some zeds they can. And we get solar plant up. Now, how much metal? Okay, so we can get let's get three. Three of these bad boys up. And I'm gonna put batteries right right next to it in a structure as well. Wall, wood. And I think one is going to be a wooden conduit wall so it lets power through. And let's get a couple of batteries in. Power. Has this got a roof on now? It doesn't. Well, that's because it hasn't been finished. Okay, fine. Um, let's get uh, the batteries in. Battery. One, two. Let's say two for now. And then normal walls around for the rest of the stuff. Oops. Uh, structure. Wooden wall. And a wooden door. Okie dokie. Right. Awesome. So McKinney, you are you hunting again? No, you're back to doing nothing. Man, you're a pain in the bum. Is there really nothing you can do? Hunting, warden, patient, doctoring, firefighting. Well, in the absence of any ill people or any fires, it's got to be hunting. Got plenty of stuff there. Twelve ration packs. So what I'm thinking is we need a conduit power conduit in here. Um, let's cancel that and let's get a wooden conduit wall. So there's the power in and then we get a power conduit to go there. So it should feed it in. Oh dear, why, why are you not you're not constructor? Damn. So Thunder's doing all the work himself. Mm. Sorry Thunder. No wonder this is going slowly. So Odile may not be a constructor, but is she... 
can she do chopping, I wonder? So let's chop wood in here. Oops, no deal. Do you do chopping? Yeah, you do. Okay, let's sort this out. So hunting is your priority. Um, actually, firefighting is priority. Okay. Now what I'm going to do differently from last time is um, with my security, when I get it up, I'm going to get the uh, turrets and the defence set up very differently from what I had last time. That was a bit of a disaster, frankly. I'm just trying to look, I'm just looking around and seeing where all the other stuff is. Around here somewhere. Ah, there we go. Last little bit of time. We shouldn't hopefully need those packaged meals. What's that? Yeah, okay. Okay. So the good news is Odile does cut trees, which is good. We run out of metal. We have run out of metal. Damn. Okay. That's not too bad because power's up, I think. No, because we haven't finished this one. Um Okay. Where's he got that metal from? Is it down here somewhere? I'm actually going to uh, restrict those. Restrict those, I think. That's too far away for now. So we need to mine out some metal, basically. Because we need to get this finished. So let's go to mine. And let's say this bit. Should be enough for now. Okay, so the third solar's up. Okay, so I see a floor there. I'm gonna have to put a gap in that wall so he can finish this area. Um, okay, let's just check power. I think power's up. Yeah, it is. Okay, so let's get uh, the production cook stove. Okay, it needs metal and a butcher's table. At the corner, but they both need metal. But we've got some digging going on. Odile's doing some mining. Good girl. And ah, sleepy time, of course. It's got plenty of wood. So what we'll do is we'll get some um, get a bedroom up. Now I've been some reading about this recently, and apparently, um, in order to make them happy about the amount of space they've got, you have to give them at least uh, 28 walkable squares in their bedroom, or you can actually get them to share a bedroom. So I think I'm actually going to do that. What I'm going to do, I'm giving them an area to share, which I think is probably a, a wiser idea. Um, less micromanagey as well. No. Okay. Right. I can see a bit of a flaw in that plan. Let's just um, deconstruct that for now. So I've got some metal being mined. And what I'm going to do is actually make that concrete. In case of fires, need defences, need growing zone, no trading capacity. What should we call this one? Um, second chance. I think that's quite appropriate. If a little unoriginal. What we do need, however, is a growing zone. I'm just worried about giving my guys a little bit too much to do. Um, but that's okay. Let's get a growing zone up. Because we do need the food. Need to be self-sufficient here. I mean, hunting is fine for now. Are these, are these guys rotting yet? Ah, oh, damn. Okay. Didn't get the butcher's table up in time. Um, I'm going to specify that I don't want any rotting animals here. Where is it? Allow rotten. Nope. Don't want any rotten corpses here. Thank you very much. Um, where was I? No money metal. I was going to all oh right, good. C cookers up, butchers butch tables up. So let's give add bill, butch creature, go forever. Thank you very much. Cooking, bill, add bill, cook simple meal, config, do it until we've got ten. Oops, sorry, that was on ten already. Perfect. Okay. Brilliant. Okey dokes. So food 
is sorted out more or less. Let me just give more instructions to hunt. McKinney, what are you doing? Still nothing. Okay, hunting time. Um, hunt. Okay, get some fresh bodies. Uh, plenty of wood, plenty of silver, really not much of anything else. A little bit struggling at the moment. Okay, third side of the panel's not up yet. I mentioned about the how they prioritise here. Is that solar panel even cute? Oh, maybe I did. I cancel it. I can't even remember. Maybe I did. Okay. Right. So we really need to get a bedroom up. Got plenty of wood. Um, let's get. We need to turn these into actual. Yep. We need to get a structure up here, and we need to make it wooden conduit wall. Going to run that along the middle here. To run it from the uh, the power, and let's make that like so. Get a door in there, and that's going to be their bedroom. We're all going to share wooden bed. Which way around that? Headboard. Okay, so you can be there. You can be there, and you can be there. Need to change the wall here to be a conduit wall. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Bro. That snake can die. Orders. Hunt. Yeah. Bye bye. Good. Got some food going. What I don't need to do just haul, is haul it all the way to storage. That's that's very bad. So I'm going to set up a zone and put it by the cooker, both for raw meat and for simple meals. And that's all it's going to be. So because it makes absolute sense. Uh, no, we don't want any of this. No, 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 none of that. We want animal corpses. We want foods. We want meals and raw. And want that to be important. This, oops, storage. Uh, we don't want there to be any food here, and no animal corpses. We want all the corpses to be brought around. Okay, good. This guy's still sleeping on the floor in the kitchen. That's not cool. Okay, structure. A wooden conduit wall. There, please. And actually, we're going to deconstruct that and get a door in. What's going on? Sort of flare. The roof has collapsed because it's too far from any support. Things across the solar generator. Oh, I see. So when I deconstructed this, this right, okay, so this has been counted as a roofed area already. Okay, I understand. That explains where that went. Um, okay. I have to do this slowly by the looks of it. I need to get this. I need to get roof over the uh, batteries. Because. No, not stone. Uh, because batteries out in the open have a bad, bad habit of exploding, which is not very cool. Okay. Is that two squares? One, two. Yep, it is need these guys to crack on with this and get some beds. Come on. So once the meat is skinned, um, it, it doesn't rot, which is actually pretty cool. Why aren't they moving these guys off? Yeah. Don't tell me we have to bury them. Come on. Just out of interest. Oh, okay. So we, the usual. Very friendly. Not so friendly and downright hostile. That's fine. Got no problem with that at all. Alrighty, where is everybody? You're hauling. What are you doing? No, where's where's the lazy sod? McKinney, what are you doing, McKinney? You're doing nothing. 
Well, actually, here you are. You are going to hunt that dude. What are you doing? Are you going to sleep? Okay, I guess. Critically short metal. Metal's here. What is everybody doing? Building wooden floors. Yeah, that's not good. Dude, you got you, you got to prioritize this, right? Prioritize working with conjure wall, and now this. Cool. And again, grab more wood if you need it. That's fine. Oh, do not put a door in. Okay, structure and door. Man, they sleep a lot. Hurry up. And this dude should be allowed to sleep at all. Put your finger out. Need you to hunt. Off to a great start here. Come on. Chop, chop. Get up. You can't be happy sleeping on the floor. Just make your beds. Come on. Can you just get this finished, please? For the love of God. Get this finished. Finishing your meal, okay. That's fine. Just crack on. Ah, oh, okay, fine. Just just do do the wall. Do the wall, please. Oh great. The deal got sick. Super. So the doer has actually got sick. That's not cool. Okay. So what we need to do is set that as medical, no deal. You're gonna go to bed. Uh, actually eat, eat first and then go to bed. Right, rest until fully healed. Got plenty of medicine. Um, oh, I see what's happening there. So let's get rid of a deal sleeping spot. That was the problem. Um, thunder, it's more important that you get a good night's sleep. The McKinney, he can stay sleeping on the floor for now. No, actually, McKinney, you are going to play Doctor, so you don't do a great deal else, and you guys don't for now. That's going to be very low priority for you. Thunder, constructing is going to be your number one thing, and a deal is going to be patient. Okay. A deal, what are you, do what are you doing? You're not healthy. Well, minor plague, rest until fully healed. Thank you very much. Is a priority overriding everything, a deal? New? Okay. Right. You're going to be a patient. Priority. So, Thunder, you need to crack on with this wall. Build a bed, that's fine. Got no problem with that. Now crack on with the wall, please. Where on earth are you going? No, no. Oh, that's McKinney. Oops. Thunder. You're hauling now. Have we run out of raw material? Is that what the problem is? I don't know, because I haven't queued it up. That's clever. Right. Structure. Wooden conduit wall. Actually, this doesn't need to be wooden conduit wall at all. Just wooden wall will be fine. That there, and that there. And now we have a roof. Now, the problem is, unfortunately, Odile, who's one of the two people who actually do stuff, is in bed. So we're going to have to cut some trees, and we need, we need more wood. So hopefully we can get this finished. Have we got enough wood? No, I don't think we do. Okay. Sleepy time. Oh, pirates. Okay. 
We'll deal with you momentarily. The good news is that McKinney actually has a bed now, so let's get rid of that. Let's have a look at the parts. Just be one, hopefully. A naked dude with a gun. Ooh. Um, where are we? He's just wearing cloth pants. Okay. Um, Melly 12. Neurotic. <laughs> he's neurotic and he's pessimistic. My word. Wow. I don't I know. I'm not going to recruit him. He's going to be much more trouble than he's worth. Damn. Lower mental break. And he's permanently miserable. E. Okay. Well, the trouble is, is I don't actually have a turret up either. So this is going to be potentially one of my guys injured. Um, mm, okay, guys, get up. Not particularly happy with this. Come over here, please. Where is he? Where's he gone? Oh, he's just mooching around. That might give us time to get a turret up. Uh, no, it won't, because you haven't got any metal. Okay. Fine. There we go. Right. Been in their assault. So, let's, f let's fall back. Um, who's the guy at Lee Enfield? Okay, so Lee Enfield's going to be back here. McKinney, be there. The deal. Even though you're sick, you're gonna be here. Come on, Thunder. The deal. Clearly, you you can't shoot him there. Is she aiming? No, she's not aiming. C can you can you not you not fire a gun? What's going on here? You're not incapable of fighting, are you? You have a pistol. But you're not shooting. What is going on? The deal. You can't hunt. Does that mean you actually can't fire a gun? Damn. Okay. Had you been hit? Um, spine torso. Okay, the deal. Come with me, please. Oh, he's down. Awesome. Um, okay. There's Eel. You need to go and rest until fully healed. McKinney has been hit. Gone shot. Pistol. He needs to heal as well. So McKinney, you're now going to go to bed. Two. Rest until fully healed, please. And Thunder, good job, mate. What I need you to do is come over here. Um, I'm not going to strip him. I don't want to capture him either, to be honest. He's going to hold his pistol. So what we'll do, just just kill the guy. Don't actually, don't really... Uh, what's that? Oh, go away. So I'm going to bring him here. Can we melee attack him? Yeah, here we go. Sorry, dude. You had to go. Strip. Just a pair of cloth pants. Want you to... Can you hold the pistol? No. Is that because this isn't set for weapons? Weapons, weapons, weapons. Yep, there we go. Okay. Now can you hold the pistol? You can't hold the pistol. Sorry. You were in draft mode, weren't you? Okay, cool. Righty-ho. So he's got to eat. Got to uh, be a warden now as well for these two injured peeps. Which is not good. So after a bit of a tough start, it's actually quite interesting how much of an impact one person makes who um, doesn't want to do hauling, constructing, anything like that. It really makes a huge impact when there's only three of them. Um, very much on the back foot at the moment. Got to try and find some time to get him buried as well. Yeah, that's not particularly helpful. Okay. What I need this guy to do is actually go and bury this guy. Um, Thunder, what are you doing? You're healing. How are these guys getting on? Okay. Heal Odile. And he's got to heal McKinney. Okay. Burying this guy becomes a very much a second priority here. Come on. Now he's healing McKinney. So McKinney has to be healed um, 
once for each of these little blood spots. Oh no. Brilliant. Job done. Right, so Thunder, what I want you to do is um, dig a grave for this guy. So let's... Orders. Oh, that's under misc, isn't it? Grave. Let's put a grave out here. And I want you to prioritise... Can you imagine what would have happened if, if the, the people who, who do things got injured, leaving the... No place configured to store the corpse. Really? I don't understand. Cannot haul human corpse. No empty place configured to store it. What's this then? Why isn't this working? I don't understand. Human corpse. It's not an animal corpse. It's not mechanoid corpse. That's cool. Cannot haul human corpse. No empty place configured to store it. Wow. Okay. That's just weird. The other thing I spotted... Oh, he's, <laughs> oh, he's done it. <laughs> the other thing I spotted was a schoolboy error I made in the last colony. This is considered to be a roofed area. Haha. <laughs> Which is why my solar panels, or one of them anyway, isn't actually producing any power. I'm not going to make that mistake twice. See, I do learn. So let's um, crack on with zoning. And we're going to zone a no roof region, which is there, there. Which means my solar panels actually can see the sun. It's always very useful. Or indeed daylight. Okay, McKinney, you, you actually look better. Oh, you're healthy again. Awesome. All right, let's turn your bed back into a normal bed. Adil, how are you getting on? Extreme plague. Oh, God. Poor girl. Okay. McKinney, you're also undrafted, dude. And Madil, you're also undrafted as well. Thunder's been busting his ass. Okay. Plenty of metal down there. Now, what we do need to do is get a couple of rudimentary... Oh, uh, deal's going to be happy. And a lone keeper. Okay. So what we need to do is we need to get a couple of turrets up. Um, that's going to be critical. I'm going to put one there. Put one at the front here. I don't anticipate anybody coming from the front, but you never know. A deal's up. What are you doing? What are you doing? No, 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 no. Why have you got up? Rest until fully healed. McKinney. You just can't do anything, can you? Ah. Oh. They're just going to rot away, like these dudes. <laughs> yeah, we're running out of food. Um, okay, Thunder, you've got to cook. Sorry about this, man. No, he's not cook. You're not cook. Oh, God. Okay, I deal. You actually, sorry, get it from your extreme plague, but you've got to cook. That sucks. Can you imagine? <laughs> the only person who can cook has got the extreme plague. The other two just don't really want to, thanks very much. Oh, and she's butchering. Man. So, as with my previous colony where Tasha was the uh, strong female lead there, it seems that Odile is in this colony. She's even harvesting a tree. But you really don't need to do that. Not injured. Oh, she's divided to immunity. <laughs> Odile, you're amazing. <laughs> No extreme play is going to slow her down, sucker. Cool. Brilliant. Okay, so everyone's back up and running now, which is absolutely fantastic. So we've got one turret up um, here, which appears to be not powered. Oh, I completely missed something. Yeah. Like an idiot. Okay. Uh, structure. Let's deconstruct that. And we're going to put up a wooden conduit wall here. Come on, wake up. Preferably not McKinney, because he doesn't do anything. Thunder or ideal. There you go. Can you deconstruct this, please? Hurry, hurry. This. No. The deal. Can you? Not constructor. There you go. Thanks, mate. Right. Uh, wooden conduit wall. Bosch. And I need Thunder to prioritise working on that. I think he is anyway. Okay. A deal's back up. We do need more metal. So I'm going to get a deal to mine here. Yeah. 
So everyone's back up and running, we can get McKinney to do some more hunting. This is what he does. Okay. Go, McKinney. Oh my god, you absolute donut. Have you... Oh, I thought that blood splot there was from him hitting thunder. Okay. Second turret's up. This turret just needs power, which he's going to do now. Okay. Good. Excellent. So in pretty good shape. We do need more trees. These are cute to be chopped down. But the only person who's going to do any chopping is Odile, who's busy mining, because she's the only one who does mining as well. Man, we got a real bunch here, haven't we? <laughs> Look at this. Is there any skills which all three of them actually do? So it's just these arbitrary ones up here. I mean, I guess these are important, but certainly not early game. Not really. Damn. Okay. So, which is more important, metal or wood? Right now. Oh, wood, I guess. Hmm, okay. Anyway, I think we'll leave it there. The um, Colony 2 is up. Second Chance Colony is up. Um, and, as you can see, we, we've got uh, we've got three people who uh, definitely have their own niches. They don't like doing certain jobs. But that's part of the remote, that's part of the challenge, and that's what I wanted to set for myself. And it certainly is a lot more difficult without cherry-picking your starting colonists. So, that's pretty interesting as well. <laughs> anyway, I hope you've enjoyed that. Um, if you did, please leave a like or leave a comment, and I will catch you for episode 2, which will be in the next day or two. Take it easy out there. Cheers. Bye.